Hi everyone. Today we are going to solve chapter number 12, three dimensional shapes. So before we are going to solve, let's see the definition of two, three dimension. Here we have the definition three dimensional shape, which is also called 3D shapes. A figure which has three dimensions. The three dimensions are height, weight and depth. Let's see the example of this definition so we can easily solve the chapter from book 2b and book 2. Here we have the example. Here I have drawn the shape with the pencil, a simple rectangle. And here I have taken a box of ink bottle which is cuboid in shape. It is rectangle and it is cuboid. So the simple rectangle is having height and length. This is all called 2D shape, 2 dimensional shape which is simply height and length. This is called 3D shape because it is having length, height and width. It is having a length, height and width. This side is called width. So the shape which is having length, height and width is 3D shape uh, and the length which is having height and length is 2D shape two-dimensional shape so hope you guys understand that what is 2d and what is 3d let's start solving the chapter in book 2 here we have page number 211 which object has both flat faces and curved surface so here this is only curved this is only flat this is only flat and this is curved and flat both the surface here we have to match the objects in the shape. This is cylinder. This shape is cube. Cube is same as the square. This is cuboid. Cuboid is same as rectangle. This is pyramid, cone and sphere. Page number 212. Here we have some shapes. We have to write the name of the shapes, number of edges, number of faces and number of vertex and vertices so the first shape is cube here we have the shape cube this is the shape of cube so first we have to write that the name of the shape is name of object cube number of edges so the edges is these line these sides these corners are the edges of the shape so here we have one two three four four edges at the upper side and four edges at the lower side four plus four eight then the remaining edges are nine ten and then eleven twelve so these are the twelve edges of cube now number of faces how many numbers of faces a cube have so let's count one two three four five and the last one is six so the cube is having six face cube and cuboid is having the same numbers cuboid and cube the only difference between them is this length the size the size is different but the edges the number of faces and vertices are same like cube is having 12 edges cuboid is also having 12 edges cube is having Six face cuboid is also having six face. You can count with me one, two, three, four, five, and then six. So, vertex is the corner where the shapes meet. Like you can see here, one, two, and three. So, this is called the vertex one, two, three, four. And then 5, 6, 7 and then the last one is 8. So it means that we have 8 vertices. We have vertex if the we have only a single here. And we have vertices if we have so many corners here. Same as it is we have the same vertices in cuboid. Number 2 shape is cylinder. So here I have the shape of the cylinder. So in cylinder I have two edges. One complete and two 
here. So these are the two edges of cylinder and the cylinder is having three face. One, two and then three face. This is also a face three and the numbers of vertices zero because no line is making this type of angle in the cylinder. Number three is the sphere. So I have a ball for the sphere as you can see. Number of edges zero because we don't have any edge in the ball in the sphere shape. Number of face. The sphere shape is having only one face. Number of vertex zero. No vertex face. Number three is we have number four we have cone. So this is a cone. Number of edges we have you can see the lines met his one. Number of face one, two. As you can see in the shape, one and two. And the number of vertex is also one. Number five shape is prism. Prism is having six edges, four number of faces. You can see one, two, three, and one on the lower side, four. And six edges, one, two, three, four, five, six. And then four vertex. And we have already done cuboid. Cuboid and cube will remain same. The only difference between them is the size. This is a cuboid. Cuboid is in rectangular shape. And this is a cube. Cube is in a square shape. So this is the complete explanation of your shapes. These all shapes are called 3D shapes. Page number 216. Here we have to take the shapes which are used in this figure. So we have used cube. You can see this small cubes. We have used cylinder. These we have used cone and cuboid. This shape. We don't use any kind of pyramid. Again, page number 217. We have to take the shapes we use. We use cube, cube, cylinder, and cuboid. Here we use cube, cuboid, cylinder, and pyramid. Page number 220. What comes next? Here if the shapes are given. We have to find out that what comes next. After this cylinder, we have a cuboid. Here you can see again cylinder, we have cuboid. Here we have cone, cube, sphere, then again cone. So this is the explanation of chapter 3D, three-dimensional shapes in book 2. Now let's start book 2B. Page number 71. Pick a, put a tick to show if the object has flat faces or, or curved surface. The balloon is having curved surface. This is a cuboid shape, flat. Flat and curved both. Only flat face. Page number 72. Circle the object that can roll, then fill in the blanks. This shape can roll, this shape can roll, and this shape can roll. The class is also roll, and this shape is also roll. This is a circle. So here we have all the shapes which can roll. We have circled. The object can roll because they are curved. Because they are curved, so that's why they can easily roll. Look at the names of the solid. Fill in the blanks in the correct numbers. Here we have the names. Pyramid, cone, cube, sphere, cuboid. I have no flat face. I have no corners. I am a sphere. I have eight corners. All my faces are square. I am cube. I have one flat face. My flat face is a circle. I am cone. And the last one is cuboid. Here we have on page number 73. Match the shapes with their name. Cone, cuboid, sphere, pyramid, cube and the last one is cylinder here we have to find out the names of the shapes in the given alphabets so first we have find cone sphere cuboid pyramid cylinder and cube we have find all the shapes name 
page number 75 here we have to cross out the shape that do not belong in each group these are group by shape so these are group by shape this shape is not belong to the same group cross and cross these are the group by size so this shape is out of the size and last is these are the group by faces so these two faces are different from the other one these all are curved faces these all are straight line faces here we have cut out pictures of objects from newspaper or magazine that shows the different solids paste them in the table i have draw you can also cut and paste from the different different books and then paste the shapes are cube cylinder cuboid cone and sphere page number 77 here we have to color the objects that are present in each shape number a here we have to color the shapes which are present in a in number b here we have to color b so in number a we have cube and cuboid only two shapes and in number b we have cube cuboid cone and cylinder all the shapes here we have circle the solid that were used to form the figure we just have to circle the solid which is used this is rectangle cuboid and this is pyramid shape cuboid and pyramid here we have use cuboid cubes and cone cuboid cube and cone these shapes are used page number 79 circle the missing shapes in each pattern here you just have to circle the missing shape the shapes the pattern is this and here are the shapes so the missing shape is after cone we have a cube so we just circle the cube here here again we have to circle the missing shapes so after this cylinder we have this cylinder we have the medium cylinder here here again we have to circle the missing shape the missing shape is cube and here the missing shape is cylinder page number 81 mind work out look at the solid shapes choose any two solids and compare so i have choose sphere and cube how they are different how are they similar so here i have written the difference and similarities between them sphere has a curved surface cube has no curved surface sphere has no flat face cube has six flat faces sphere has no corner and cube has eight corners so these two shapes are completely different from each other they are not similar here we have math journal use the drawing tools on your computer to draw solid print and cut out the solid you can use your computer and draw some different shapes and then take out the print of the shapes you you have drawn and then paste them in your book solid with flat faces here are the solid with flat faces solid without flat face sphere page number 83 review 12 circle the shapes that have both curved surface and flat surface so this shapes are curved and flat look at the solid the shapes of the shaded face is square i have no flat face i can roll what am i circle the correct answer so this is a square here again we have to circle the missing shape so the missing shape is cone cuboid pyramid and again cone so this is the complete explanation of your chapter so this is the complete explanation of your chapter number 12 3d dimension